you use iMessages on your iPhone, but how do you do it from your MacBook? Send and receive Apple iMessages from your Mac. I'm gonna show you how it looks on the Mac right now and also how to set it up. So first, here is the Messages app on the MacBook and you can view your messages. You can view just unread messages. You can view all messages and you can of course send and receive messages as well. Okay, so how this works is if I send a test message from here, just a standard message, that actually appears, syncs from my phone to my MacBook. So I can see that message on my MacBook and on my phone. And I can send a message or I can hit reply as well. And that will also appear on my phone. So how do you set all of this up? It's actually pretty easy. Okay, so to automatically forward texts to your other devices, you need to be signing in to iMessage. So this is on the iPhone, for example. And you've got to be using the same Apple ID on both your iPhone and on your MacBook. Let me show you on the iPhone first. Okay, so on the iPhone, first of all, we go into settings and then down to iMessage, messages rather. And there you want to go down, scroll down to text message forwarding here. And then you want to point to the other device that you want to forward your messages to. Remember, they both need to be logged in using the same Apple ID. So I'm going to turn that on. And then on your MacBook Pro, you do the same. You can go to Messages. I'll hit the Command and the Space Bar to search for the Messages app if you don't have it open. And then you sign in with the same Apple ID. Did I mention that? <laughs> Now, if you do have problems either seeing the send forwarding, the text forwarding of the text messages or seeing your messages either on your iPhone or on your Mac, then make sure that you're on the latest version of the iOS. You go into settings and then update to your latest version. And also check out the Apple pages, which I have linked below in the description to this video. I really find that having the text messages ability on my laptop just allows me to type, especially if I want to send out a lot of messages quickly. It's much easier than typing on my iPhone.